what is up guys welcome back to another vlog i know where the heck have i been <laughs> A lot of things have happened since I've last vlogged. Um, it's been about a month and a lot of things have happened but also not really much has happened if that makes any sense at all. I don't really know. On the weekends we don't really do much anymore and it's not like not in a depressing way or anything. It's just school starting up. Well it did start up so it's just kind of taking a lot of time doing that and then we're busy with work so and we also haven't taken any trips lately so that's also another reason why we haven't really been vlogging but today is Sunday and um, I just kind of wanted to catch you guys up on what's been going on we're gonna be getting some vlogs coming up here so this is kind of the start to the vlogs that are coming so that you guys kind of know what's been going on um also first I want to say I am in the car it is raining and I am just waiting for Daniel because he's getting hair cut um, his friend is cutting his hair so I'm in the car and that's why I'm here by myself just chilling <laughs> so if you hear raindrops that's why but anyways so what has been going on with me well a lot of things I'm still working out at the kickboxing gym if you were curious I tried to do I tried to challenge myself to where I worked out for 27 days, which is a weird number I know, but I'll explain in a minute. I wanted to work out every single day for 27 days. So I'm starting something new. We've been working out for four months now and we've been going probably about three to four times a week, which is good, but I wanna see if I can push myself. Starting yesterday, and yesterday was the 15th, I'm gonna see if I can work out every day that the gym is open, which is Monday through Saturday, until September 11th, which is 26 days as of today, in 26 days. Um, so I think, not counting all of the Sundays, it should be 23 days total. So I'm gonna try to see if I can work out for 23 days in a row. Today will be day two. Here we are, first Friday. Gonna get it done. That's how that workout made me feel. And it was going well, I would say, except I ended up getting sick. So today is the first Saturday that I would have gone to the gym, but for some reason I feel really sick. Like I have just like mucus build up in the back of my throat. I don't know what it is, but I took medicine and it's now 11.40. I am wearing a workout shirt and I was getting dressed and I just like laid down and said like, I just really can't even try to do this. I don't want to push myself too hard. Today's the 20th. It's a Monday and it's the Monday after I missed the Saturday morning because I was sick and I am missing today because I am still sick. I feel like crap. And then the whole thing was just a miserable experience and it was a failure. So I wasn't able to continue with that challenge. So <laughs> that would have been a really good challenge video had I done it and stuck with it. But hopefully once we get back into vlogging, that I can start that up again and hopefully I don't get sick again so that it doesn't ruin everything <laughs> but the reason why I had done a 27 day challenge was because the day that I started it it was gonna be 27 days up until we left for our trip um, we actually leave for our trip in two days so I am really excited about that Daniel and I are super excited um, I'm not gonna say where yet but you'll see um, there will be travel vlogs um, we'll be vlogging while we're there so we're really excited about that and some other exciting things have been going on um, I have actually upgraded my camera gear I have something very exciting I switched completely from Canon to Sony, which is a crazy thing to do. I was really nervous, only because I was so used to the Canon system and I was really nervous of just switching over and like 
learning something new and my gear is like a big part of what we do because if you don't know daniel and i started a little business we're not really making a lot of money off of it right now which is no big deal like we're just starting out where i'm not even worried about that but we've been doing a lot of shoots we've been doing engagement photos we've been doing birthday photos headshots and just a lot of fun things like daniel and i really 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 love doing it and I think it was just really time for me to upgrade my equipment because I was using the Canon T7i, which is a really great, 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 great camera. Like I loved it, but I wanted a full frame. I wanted to be able to maximize my photos and Daniel had the Sony a7 III. So I just thought like, if we're gonna be doing this business together, it would be really great if our stuff looked the same so that when we're editing, you know, it's just streamlined and we have the same camera and it's really good for video and it's really good for photos and it's a full frame camera. So yeah, I just did the upgrade, he upgraded too. So now we both have the same camera and we're really excited about that. So I also upgraded from the Canon G7X to the G7X Mark II. Here is the G7X Mark I. Here is the G7X Mark II. And I really like it so far. Um, I can see why a lot of people's break because the flip out screen is a little flimsy and I can see how the screws can get loose. But other than that, I really like it. I like the quality. I think it's way better than the first version and I'm, I'm happy with it. So if you're interested, I'll have that camera link down below, but I think it was a good choice and I have no complaints so far. So we're good on that. So other than those updates, we haven't really been doing much, just hanging out with family on the weekends and enjoying the last little bit of summer that we have. Although it's still gonna be hot until probably November here in Texas. But like I said, we're going on a trip, which I'm super excited about. We leave in two days. We'll definitely be vlogging while we're there, so stay tuned for that. Those will be the next vlogs coming up. And yeah, I'm just really excited to jump back into it. I've missed vlogging so much and I'm so glad that I am back. I got new camera gear, things are gonna be popping and I'm so excited. So yeah, other than that guys, I am gonna sit here and wait for Daniel to get done because I'm starving and we're gonna get something to eat. So I'll see you guys in a minute. Okay, we decided to come to Olive Garden. Got some spaghetti. I don't know what the heck he got, but <laughs> it looks good. Chicken on something else. Stuffed chicken. Oh, stuffed chicken. Is that mashed potatoes? Yep. Dang. Okay, okay. Well, that was good, right, babe? It was delicious. It was delicious. I had been wanting Olive Garden for the past, like, two weeks, so. Mm, this is back up on you. That one? Yeah, oh no, it's a, it's a, it looks kind of like it, but it's not it. <clears throat> Anyways. <laughs> um, yeah, it was good. It was delicious. Now I could take a nap. All right, you guys, that is going to be the end of today's vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm sorry it was a short one and it was mostly me catching you up on what's been going on in my life lately, but I felt like that was pretty necessary because I've been a little MIA for the last month. But anyways, I'm going to be back at vlogging. Stay tuned for the next videos because you're going to see where we're going for our trip and it's going to be really fun and exciting. So I will see you guys then. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.